Hello everyone, welcome to the Narc Survivor YouTube channel. And in this video, I'm going to be talking about how the narcissist will betray you no matter what you do for them. Please give this video a thumbs up down below as it will help the YouTube algorithm to get this message out there. No matter what you do or don't do, the narcissist will always end up being disloyal and unfaithful to you. They will always disappoint your hopes and expectations. They will break their promises. They will always let you down in the end. But what gives them the ability to do that is your belief. Your acceptance that something exists or is true. When you don't even have any proof. Because as long as you have this blind faith and confidence in the narcissist, you will experience unfortunate circumstances. When you finally come to your senses and you realize that you have made a very big mistake. Because no matter what you do for them, they will always cheat, swindle and exploit you in the end. It's just your belief that keeps you holding on as you're going through this cycle of perceived loss and gain, where you're doubting yourself, while they're not even thinking about you in a serious way. Because while you may not see it at the time, they already know that you're worth far more than what you're settling for. So they know that at some point you're going to get cold feet and you're going to realize that you've made a bad investment which is why they've always got one foot out the door. Because they're just waiting for that moment when you wake up and you finally realize what you've gotten yourself into. But until that point, you're still giving them your serious consideration. You're giving careful thought and reflection as though you actually believe that it could amount to something worthwhile in the future because they've managed to gain your acceptance and belief, which are really the only things they need to keep you stuck. Because you should already know what you're dealing with after witnessing the behaviors over a long period of time. So you should continue in this course of action with commitment and without any doubt, instead of treating them as though they're not your enemy or opposition, because that's only going to put you back where you started. It's not going to cause you to gain any ground. It's only ever going to set you back even more. Which is why you must move in a certain way so that you can protect yourself by being aware of what they're trying to do to you. Because all they're trying to do is destroy you. If you're finding this video helpful, please do give it a thumbs up down below. Thank you. But yes, they may come to you and try to play the victim. But they are always the initiators of everything that goes wrong. Because they orchestrate it all. They're just trying to get you to feel sorry for them so that you don't leave them. Because they know that you're empathic. So of course it's very easy for them to play on your mind because you want to help. You don't want to let anyone down. That might make you feel guilty. So you want to be the one who rescues them. But by doing that, you are making a big mistake because you should be taking away your belief and acceptance from what is being presented. And instead you should be looking at it from a rational point of view where you're able to make a sensible decision because there is a clear ongoing pattern of behavior which should reveal to you that something is not right. It should allow you to remove yourself from the situation emotionally because everything they're telling you or displaying to you is just to leave you unprotected where you are then vulnerable to attack when you were just trying to help them because that is how they keep you stuck. You can't help them. They don't even want you 
to help them. They just want to punish you. So if you trust and believe in them, they're just going to drain you of your resources and support until you finally come to the conclusion that you should have trusted your better and initial judgment of never getting involved with them to begin with. Because it's never going to be any good for you. It's never going to work to your advantage. They just managed to instill this belief in you that there is something good about them. When really, there is nothing good about them. It's just a false appearance so that they can get something out of you. But many people choose not to believe it and they strive forward in an attempt to assist someone who is only going to exploit them in the end because it is all a game. And whether you get played or not really depends on your belief. It depends on whether or not you're still hopeful when you accept them as honest and deserving, even though you may have doubts, because that is what puts you into trouble, where you're overlooking their ongoing patterns of behavior, which is only going to repeat itself, because they're only going to continue their reckless self-sabotage behavior, even while you're trying to help them, because that's just the nature of their disorder. They always do things that block their own success and prevent them from accomplishing their own goals. They always mess it up in the end, even when things are going well, because deep down they know that they don't deserve it. They know that they're lying to you and deceiving you. So they already know it's not going to amount to anything because at some point you're going to wake up and you're going to realize who and what you're actually dealing with. And then you're going to want to get rid of them. But by that point, you, have all, you will have already lost so much from dealing with them. And what got you to this point was your belief in them. Which is why if you believe you're dealing with a narcissist, you should never second guess yourself. And you should trust that you're making the right decision in taking yourself away from them. Because collaborating with them is only going to put you at a disadvantage. It's only going to set you back in life. It's never going to leave you in a better position than where you started. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Share your thoughts in the comment section. Hit the subscribe button to receive the notifications. If you would like to support the channel, you can donate at paypal.me slash narcsurvivor. You can book a one-on-one -on -one with me on my website. It's narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.